morning guys, uh, it's uh, Saturday morning, Anzac day, um, we've got a bit of a, a different day today, different video, we're going to call it uh, Tech Tech Saturday, so uh, what we're doing is we're going to head over to Greenie's Garage, so you haven't seen Greenie's Garage yet, this is a new, uh, new feature, so we've got the Husky in the back, um, we're going to do a valve adjustment today, so um, we're going to spend a little bit of time adjusting the valves. We're going to show you how to do it and the process. Um, we're going to have a little bit of fun all, along the way. It's going to be exciting. So this is something that you should do to your uh, engine, uh, to your valves. There's different specifications, but um, on you know, as far as hours are concerned, uh, just check your manuals. But uh, this is something that we um, you know, really should be doing and checking. So. Um, I'm really looking forward to this video. I think it's going to be really informative and really exciting um, if you're into Kawasaki engines or anything with a um, an overhead valve. So uh, stay tuned, and I'll um, I'll see you in Greenie's garage. So that's the valve cover there, guys. We've taken that off. So feeler gauge. This is our valves. So we're just about to adjust them. See how loose they are, just see how it feels. Feel that, Dean? See how you can feel a little bit of resistance? Yep. That's pretty much, just maybe a little bit more. Too tight. That's just a little bit that's, of grab. That's a bit, bit too tight. Can you feel that, hear that? Yep. That's just a tin thing, it's a bit too tight. Too tight. I'm happy with that. Perfect. And you just lock that up. Yep. Feel that. I'll give you to feel that so you know. Nice and loose and relaxed. Yeah. This is when you do it. All right. Let's have a look and see what we've got here. That's pretty loose, man. There's nothing there. There's no resistance. Wow. <laughs> there you go. I will adjust that. But that there's so much tighter. I like that a lot. Okay. What do I get you to do? I just want to check that that's really loose, relaxed. Yeah, let's do that. So we're going to go like this. Take that, loosen that off. There as well. It's probably the wrong size. Back, but Okay, so we'll whack that in there. Move to see that one there. Just, yep. just loosen that off and tighten them down. I always tighten it down so it's really tight and just back off a little bit. So we're getting, we're almost, that's pretty much a little bit more. That's, that's. Can you hear that? Yep. And that there feels good to me. That's a lot better than what it was. This one here, see there's nothing there. Yeah, very loose, isn't it? So just go back in there, nip that right up. Yep. See, it's tight as grabbed. Yep. Let's back off a little bit. Just a little bit tight. That's grabbing there. Yeah, okay. Let's put a little bit more here. Thing is, every time you loosen that lock nut, it um, loosens the valve. There you go. I like that. It's a little bit tight. I like that, man. Cool. Let's see if we can, um, it's just a little tight. 
you got yep I like that a lot there you go we just nip them up and they're done nice Happy with that? Yeah, I reckon that is freaking sexy ass. <laughs> <laughs> that is that's done. So now we've got to jump to that side and do that, seal it up, so and come done. over to this side. And yeah, so uh, this hasn't been done. So these are where are we? See how tight? That's actually really loose. That's tight. So we've got to make sure that's top dead center. That I reckon probably is. So just in that video there guys, I just noticed when you, uh, we missed a step, when you adjust the valve, you wanna make sure that the uh, piston is up at uh, top dead center. So you gotta make sure that the um, the piston's up at top dead center and then check the valve spacing. So um, just a little tip there. Hopefully you enjoyed that video. Um, I'm just on my way back from uh, Greeny's garage now, but, um, yeah, I think that was that was good. That was something a little bit different. Um, just wanted to say thanks uh, so much, guys, for watching. Uh, Greeny and I, we've had a great day um, having a bit of a tinker around with the um, with the, the spacings um, and the valves. So the engine's running a lot smoother. It sounds great. Um, just wanted to say a big thank you to Greeny uh, for that. I really appreciate your help. Um, and it's good, it's, you know, just helping each other out. Just uh, that mateship thing. Um, you know, I think it's really important that we all uh, kind of connect together and sort of help each other out, give ourselves, uh, each other, hints and tips. Um, it's a great thing. It's, um, it's a win-win uh, situation. So, um, you know, he's Bobcat is back there it's uh, got 267 hours on it and we've booked that in we're gonna probably um, do that around Christmas time we're gonna try and um, book that in and and get it um, get the valves the valves adjusted on that and I'll give him a hand um, to do that so you know help each other out guys um, have a great weekend uh, be good to each other uh, and um, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. See you guys.